thin and light laptops. They are some of the best devices for getting work done on the go. And one of the most popular sizes for this laptop category is 13 inches. At this size, the laptops have a small footprint, allowing you to place them on a table without taking up a lot of space from the other things. It's also easier to place them on surfaces that are constrained for space, like the armrest of a sofa, the glove box of a car, a coffee table and still have space for your coffee, and of course, on a slim lap. Moreover, the compact size means that they'll fit into smaller bags, so there's no need to carry huge, bulky bags just for your laptop. Alternatively, with these laptops being, as their category name suggests, thin and light, you can just carry them in your hand if you wanted to. Well, the laptop you just saw being used to demo the practicality of thin and light laptops is the MSI Prestige 13 EVO. MSI says that this laptop is able to provide the best thin and light experience without some of the drawbacks that come with being a thin and light laptop. We'll find out exactly what they mean as we make our way through the features of the Prestige 13 EVO starting with the design. Available in stellar grey, the Prestige 13 EVO has a minimalist design with a silver MSI logo on this colorway. This understated look makes it easy on the eyes and won't attract unnecessary attention when you're working at a coffee shop. The magnesium aluminium alloy chassis not only feels premium, but makes this laptop super light. How light? Well, it's lighter than my fluid mechanics textbook. At just 990 grams, it's so light, you could do something silly like this and get away with it. Before we get on with it, let's look at the pots. Normally, you'll get a very limited selection of pots on thin and light laptops as the space is limited on the count of them being thin. However, MSI has managed to squeeze in a decent selection of pots. On the left, you get DC in, HDMI 2.0, two Thunderbolt 4 pots, and a headphone microphone combo jack. On the opposite side, you get a micro SD card reader and USB A 3.2 Gen 1. All great, but those two Thunderbolt 4 pots are the real stars. Besides supporting USB PD charging up to 100 watts and data transfers up to 40 gigabits per second, a single Thunderbolt 4 port can support up to two 4K displays at 60 Hz through a dock. But if you have a Thunderbolt 4 capable monitor and devices, you can daisy chain them together. What this means is that you can connect your laptop and an external storage hub to the monitor and your laptop can still access the storage hub through the monitor. If the monitor has a beefy power supply, it can even charge the Prestige 13 EVO through the same Thunderbolt 4 cable. You can do this as long as all the devices support Thunderbolt 4. As for wireless connectivity, there's the high-speed Wi-Fi 6E on board along with Bluetooth 5.2. Opening the lid, which you can do with one hand, you'll be greeted by a bright and colourful 13.3-inch IPS-level display with a 1920 by 1200 resolution giving it a taller 16 by 10 aspect ratio. This gives more vertical screen real estate, allowing you to view more content on a single page. This is particularly useful in Microsoft Excel, where you can see more rows displayed on the screen. At the top of the display sits the 1080p webcam with a physical shutter and IR cameras for Windows Hello facial recognition. There's also a fingerprint scanner in the function row for another means of biometric authentication. The keyboard is backlit, making it easier to view in the dark. One nice touch is that MSI placed the delete key at the end of the row instead of the fingerprint scanner, as this is common placement of the key in many laptop keyboards. Therefore, you won't be turning off the laptop every time you want to delete a word because of muscle memory. The laptop lid also lifts the keyboard to an angle when you open it, making typing more comfortable and allowing airflow to the intake fans for the hardware components. And that screen can be pushed all the way down. Convenient for using the laptop when standing up or finding the right screen angle when on a laptop stand. MSI has also made good use of the available space and included a large touchpad. It's large enough to navigate Windows 11 that you'll rarely find yourself at the edge of the touchpad. Speaking about Windows 11, this is a great time to talk about performance as the Prestige 13 EVO packs a punch. It's one of the first laptops to feature Intel's 13th Gen mobile processors. In this case, it's an Intel Core i5 1340p processor with 4 performance cores and 8 efficiency cores for a total of 12 cores with a boost frequency of up to 4.6GHz. 
MSI has chosen to go with a P-series variant of this processor which has up to 28 watts of power compared to 15 watts on the U-series, which is more common in thin and light devices. The Prestige 13 EVO is configured with 16GB of LPDDR5 RAM and 1TB of fast NVMe PCIe Gen 4 SSD storage. For the kinds of productivity work this laptop is designed to do, like typing a report in Microsoft Word or creating a graph in Microsoft Excel, the processor, RAM and storage won't even break a sweat. And you will be able to stay productive for long periods of time thanks to the large 75 watt hour battery, which is impressive given the size of the Prestige 13 EVO and is uncommon for a thin and light laptop. Paired with the more efficient 13th gen Intel Core processor, MSI estimates you can get up to 16 hours of battery life depending on your usage. When the battery eventually runs low, there's support for fast charging which can take the battery from 20% to 60% in 53 minutes with the included 65W USB-C charger. As mentioned earlier, the Prestige 13 EVO also supports up to 100W USB-C PD charging. Well, that is the end of the feature tour of the MSI Prestige 13 EVO. If you're in the market for a thin and light laptop to easily carry around with you without having to charge it frequently and has the performance to handle productivity apps with ease, you can find more details on the Prestige 13 EVO with the link in the description. If you enjoyed watching this video, give it a thumbs up to show your support to everyone who worked hard on this project. Also, do consider subscribing to our channel so they get to keep their jobs. You can also follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and TikTok to get the latest news on almost everything. Thank you for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye!